little tiles that are Windows mm -hmm. 10, by the way. This is loaded with Windows 10, PSN, by the way. And that's a big deal that it's loaded by, with Windows 10, right? This is great. And let me explain something about Windows 10. There is no Windows 11, there is no Windows 12. Microsoft is constantly improving Windows 10, which means that these updates, they're sending out updates, they're free, which means new functionality is added uh, about twice a year, and updates are always happening on Windows 10 to make sure that you're safe and secure and that your operating system is running the way that it should. So you have that peace of mind of also knowing that Microsoft has built the best operating software in terms of Windows yet, and it just keeps getting better. And one of my favorite parts, of course, you do not have to pay any additional for these updates. And you know, speaking of Windows 10, let's touch on laptop. How do I self-diagnose that I need a new laptop or that it's time for me to upgrade? Can you share with us a little bit more about that? Because maybe you're watching right now and you're like, I know that my laptop might feel a little snow, but I don't really mind so much. There are some key indicators that say you absolutely should upgrade right now. Absolutely. So if it takes you a long time to load up your computer and you're just waiting and waiting, that's sign number one, right? Mm -hmm, right sign number sure. two. How about you constantly have to have your computer plugged in because your battery life is nil. You have yeah. very little battery life. It's so frustrating and you always have to be plugged in. This computer has up to nine hours and a half of battery life. That is insane how much battery life this has. There are so many things that you can look at. And you might necessarily think when you load a, up a website, oh boy, you know, it's my internet connection that's low. No. Websites have become more graphically intense than ever, so you have to make sure that your processor can handle it, handle the graphics and performance that are coming along with these websites, as well as your browser. So there's a lot of indications. Basically, if you're frustrated with old technology, it's time to upgrade and it's time to give yourself the experience that you deserve. And you've got an incredible responsive touchscreen, which Rachel's using mm -hmm. uh, on her computer. Yep. Look at that. It's so responsive and easy to use. Once you have touchscreen, and Rachel, you can maybe back me up on this. You will never want to go back, right? Yeah. You just get used to it. You definitely don't. Just like on your phone, on a tablet that you might have, that capacitive touch is so great. It makes the experience um, so easy and intuitive. And, you know, speaking of a very great sign that lets you know that you need a new laptop is that if you have something that has the previous versions of Windows? Like, um, are they even supporting Windows 7 and Windows 8 anymore? Because that might be a reason you must upgrade right now, right, Alex? Right, so Windows 7, Microsoft has told us, they are done supporting that, which means that you can't necessarily get any help from Microsoft with Windows 7, but more importantly is the safety and security that comes along with that, because hackers they're pretty creative. They're working day to day to try to steal information and do evil things out there. Windows 7, there are no more security updates that are coming along with that. However, with Windows 10, they're being proactive. They send them out all the time. You've got Windows Defender built into this computer, which is like an antivirus that's built into Windows 10. So it's very important that you have that because now more than ever, people are out there trying to do evil things with your information. So it's important that you have an operating system that makes sure that your computer is safe and secure. And Windows 10 certainly does that. Wow, I love that, that it actually has those kind of guardrails around my personal information and whatever I'm doing yeah. on my laptop. Now, um, just to let you know that if you're just joining us, I'd love to have you call us if you have an HP. 1-800-395-1601. We're shopping for this. It's a sale price on a 17-incher that is less than seven pounds. It's beautiful. I mean, honestly, Alex, the picture is so vivid. I love how it feels. I'd love to give you a tour because I want you to know that when you get this home, you are getting, first of all, in HP. Second of all, like a fine piece of technology, but this is really your key to being able to have those Zoom meetings, to be able to connect with everybody that is now so much more important than ever before, uh, to be able to be productive at home, to know that when you, you know, lock into your Wi-Fi at home, you are going to be able to do those documents. You're going to be able to stream videos or stream movies or get books if you'd like from the library. This is your world. We know that now mm -hmm. and now more than ever. It is. And there are things Things that we actually have that we ask HP to keep in this computer that you're not going to find in other computers out there. And can we even just start there? Because I of love course. the fact that we actually still have the, let me get this here. 
There it is. Yeah, the DVD drive. There right. You, yeah, that's a big yeah. deal. Like if you. It were, is a big deal. Tell us about that and tell us why. Sure thing. So, so many of you, we know you have DVDs, you have audio CDs, and you enjoy listening to them. But listen, how how many of us now have standalone CD players or DVD players in the household? Not a lot of us, right? Because we're doing a lot more streaming. So isn't it great to have the convenience of having it in your computer on a beautiful 17-inch display so that many people can kind of sit around the couch and enjoy it? So you've got that. We left that in there for you. Right next to that, you've got a USB port. Oh, that's the no, Kensington lock. Sorry. I love the fact that we have that there. That's okay. That's a wonderful thing to have because you can actually lock your computer. So let's say, for example, uh, you go to the coffee shop and you need to step away. You can purchase a little lock and lock your computer there. Got it. Then if you want to slide on down, you'll see that we've got a USB port there. That's great. So you can connect everything from an external hard drive or a mouse, pretty much anything that has a USB port. You can also charge your phone. Next to that, you have an SD card reader. Now, this is great for multiple reasons. One, if you have like a digital camera, for example, you can take that out, put that in here, start transferring your photos back and forth. But you can also expand the internal storage of your computer if you want to by buying an SD card. They are so inexpensive. I love the fact that we have that on the computer. Then on the other side, let's take a look right over here. We've got the headphone and microphone jack. By the way, this computer also has Bluetooth. So if you have maybe Bose headphones that you purchased from QVC or any type of uh, Bluetooth device, you can use that as well. But you have the standard headphone and microphone jack there. Right next to that, you've got two super speed USB ports. These are actually 10 times faster than your standard USB. So if you have to transfer large files, let's say videos, for example, or photos, they'll transfer in a matter of seconds as opposed to a matter of minutes. Then right there, one of my favorite ports, it's an HDMI out. A lot of us are doing working from home, so we might need to work on multiple monitors. I actually have my computer right now plugged into a monitor so that I can see what I'm doing. You can also use that if you want to extend your display and maybe watch something on your big screen TV. You just plug in any standard HDMI cord and that'll work. Right there, Rachel, that right now is a lifesaver. That's an Ethernet port. Let's say, for example, your Wi-Fi at home isn't necessarily reliable. Your kids are going to school. Maybe everyone in the house is using Wi-Fi. Well, you can hardwire your internet so that you can have a safe, secure, and uninterrupted internet connection. This is incredible to have right now. Next to that is very simple. That's your power input. And then I want to show you right up here is one of our other lifesavers, one of the things that we all live by now. It's our webcam. It's our HP TrueVision HD webcam right up here. So you can use that to Skype. You can use that for video calls. You can use that to take pictures and record video. You know, if your kids are into uh, Twitch, which is the gaming network, you can uh, the gaming streaming service, you can use that as well. It's a lifesaver also to have this webcam. So, Rachel, we have pretty much everything in here. We haven't cut any corners. That's why this computer is so incredible from top to bottom. Beautiful. And if you want one that's really special, you're going to get the black oil slick or you're going to get the jasmine blue. I mean, seriously, yeah. like check out the outside. Like even when you fold it closed, look how right. pretty that is. And then inside. And by the way, this is a backlit keyboard, so oh, yeah. um, which is a big deal. That's not the case on all laptops. Not all laptops have them. Oh, you can see Alex. Go ahead. Do your keyboard. Here we go. So right now you can see how dark it is, right? And it's hard to see my keyboard. Yeah, we'll take a look. I'm just going to hit the little F5 button here and you see how the keys came to life. Well, I can hit it one more time and dim it even further. So I'm going to try that again. Wow. There it is full speed. Then I just hit it and it dims a little bit and then that's completely off there. You can see how challenging it is to see and one more time. All right, I it's love it. And you have a full numeric keyboard as well on the other side. Sure and a do. lot like so what you see if you could even find laptops anywhere, oftentimes smaller versions of keyboards, right? They mm -hmm. don't have the numeric yeah. keyboard. They don't have the DVD drive. And why do we care about the right. DVD drive? I'll tell you why I care about the DVD drive because because Indiana Jones, right? <laughs> because The Godfather, because um, all my Disney movies, because I have movies on DVD still um, and that 
I don't know where I'm going to play them except for right here. And we That's actually right. have a 17 inch screen. So welcome on in. I'm Rachel. This is Alex Abrahantes. I'm going to do a little Ooh. kind of back and forth with some questions with him because I know that as you're buying a new laptop, it's a very exciting purchase. P.S. And by the way, oh, and that time is a little bit wrong um, because it's uh, let me see QVC. Okay. Here we go. Um, it's a very exciting purchase. Why? Because right now everybody needs a laptop. But the other thing about it is because when you get something new and you know that you're going to get something speedy and that is like fast, uh, quick like lightning, which is what it really is, uh, this is the time. This is the place. 17 inches are going to be very, very hard to find. The fact that we even have any 17 inches is incredible when it comes to laptops. Uh, I've gone into tech stores right now and I'm seeing nothing on store shelves. And so we've kind of moved up all the those really great holiday gifts because shipping and handling is a question mark as is everything right. in the world that's been a question mark this year. So under $700 for the one without Microsoft 365, under $750 for the one that has it. You can get any color that you want with or without that Microsoft 365. But let me share with you that at 140 Right now, getting home a 17 inch tablet, a laptop rather, like that is an absolute must. Come on, jump on in, the water's fine. But my recommendation to you would be step up to the extra $10 on that easy pay and definitely buy this laptop with the 365. It's coming with more than $425 of services and software. It's also coming with the option to put this on 12 months of special financing if you happen to be shopping with your Q card, which means when you do that 12 month special financing, you have until this time next year to pay for it and you have no interest or promotional fees. There are minimum payments, but you're still getting it right now. You, we're approaching 200 of these spoken for in the show. It's E234297. I have that black oil slick and the jasmine blue. I'll turn it around because these are the two that are most distinctive when it comes to uh, actually, what do you call this, Alex? What is this? What is this called? The deck? What is this part? <laughs> the key outside of the keyboard? What is this called? Because it's a beautiful yes. space. It is. So this is considered the C deck and it's actually just the keyboard area. And you can see and one of the things that I personally love about this. First off, this looks beautiful on camera. It looks even more oh, beautiful absolutely. in person. I can't tell you the amount of folks that I've shown this to who are blown away when they see this in person. And depending on how you look at it, you see different colors. And then you'll notice something particular I wanted to point out in the jasmine blue because sure. this is the first time that we're ever showing jasmine blue. Today's the first time that we've debuted it. Look at the, the on button, the power button. It's actually on the, um, the top left there. It's even a special color there. You see that? Yeah. It's like an aqua color. This is just an absolutely stunning computer. I love staring at it. Courtney was saying it's like an ocean blue. It does make you feel like you're at the ocean, right? Yeah, it's absolutely beautiful. And you know what? Anything to us inspire us in this time and, you know, in this moment that we're kind of going through right now. But here's the thing. The reality is, is that this is the wow gift to yourself, to your family, uh, to everybody that you know in the sense of this is the one that is going to allow you to communicate with them maybe better. Um, maybe you're going to give it to your mom or your dad and maybe they're not traveling. My mom and my dad are not traveling and I'm grateful for, for it because they're paying attention to their health and I'm glad that they're not traveling. But if you happen to be sitting in your home, where can you like fantasize and travel all around the world? As I said, I pulled up Maldives images, you know, whatever is going to make you really happy, right? And you can, I can actually make one of these images, Alex, my screensaver, right? You can. As a matter of fact, I have something special for you, Rachel, that I think you're going to love. So there's a program built into Windows 10 called Maps, and it's actually one of my favorite features because it does exactly what you're talking about. It gives us the opportunity to visit places that we might not normally be able to visit. So in this day and age, you're right, it's challenging to travel. However, what we can do is we can go here to 3D cities and we can take a trip around the world if we wanted to so right now we're leaving the u.s let's see i think we are in uh are we in france i believe yeah i think we're in province right now and look what i can do and by the way this is graphically intense and intense i am pinching and zooming and going 360 degrees this is actually the town that i am visiting and going through this isn't some type of 
artist rendition, this is the real deal. So if I want to see what a town is like, what a city is like, I have the ability to do that. But just like I went there, I can, at a touch of a button, head on over to the girl of US of A to Ann Arbor, Michigan, and take a look at that. Within a matter of seconds, I am here.